It is with great sadness that we announce the passing of our beloved father, Hugh Lawrence Lifcott, also known as Scotty, Uncle Hugh, and Papa of Maricel, who passed away at the Victoria Hospital on Wednesday, April 30th at 1.30 p.m. He was 78 years old. Left to mourn are his five daughters. Michelle Callender of York Hill Leclery, employee of the Star Publishing Company, who was also his caretaker. Jacqueline Callender of York Hill Leclery, teacher at the Anglican Primary School. Gertrude Church Charles of Enchipo, employee of the Ministry of Education. Brenda Seward in Maryland, USA. Karen Lorenzen in Connecticut. Four sons, Donald Sherwin Callender of Marisil, employee of TG Storing Service. Hamilton Rudy Octav and family of Grosley, proprietor of Octav's Autobats. Ian Lorenzen and family in Connecticut. Steve Lorenzen and family in Connecticut. Two sisters, Jane Joseph and family in Trinidad and Tobago. Cecilia John and family in Cicero. Thirteen grandchildren, Rudel Octav, student of the Ave Maria Girls Primary School. Trisha Black of York Hill, Leclary. Dana Jachals, employee of Ministry of Health, Division of Gender Relations. Emile Octave, PC506 of the Royal St. Lucia Police Force. Stevan Octave of Corinth. Stephanie Lawrenson of Bellevue Viewfort. Dylan and Lorenzo Ross in Connecticut. Jacob, Josiah, Helena, and Jaquan Lawrenson in Connecticut. Stephen Lawrenson Jr. in Connecticut. Twelve nieces, both here and abroad, including Melissa John and Yanif Dubisson of Cicero. Ten nephews, both here and abroad, including Randolph and Andy Henry and the families of Castries. Trevor John and family of Carrilly, Alec and Alvin John of Cicero. Two sons-in-law, Noel Charles of Enchipo, Ken Seward of Maryland. Two daughters-in-law, Myrtle Octave of Rosalie, proprietress of Octave's Auto Parts. Anne Marie Lorenzen in Connecticut, one aunt, Ivania Burke, and family in Las Vegas. Many cousins, both here and abroad, to numerous to mention, including Cuthbert Burke and family in Cicero, Marilyn and Selma, Kennedy, Alistair, and Virgil Burke, and their families of Castries and Viewfort. Gloria, Marilyn, June, Norma, Accordia, Veve, Davidson, Benjamin, Leonard, Team, Oman, Milton, and Ricky Daniel, and the families of La Pansy. Also left to mourn are Genevieve Callender of York Hill, Leclery, Agatha Hart of Connecticut, Helen Octave of Pavi, Katie Victorine of Miku, Austin Hinkson and family, Michael George, also known as Tree and family, Claudia Lou Squires and family of Citygate, Nova Alfred and family of Union, Rudolph Fiovel of Leclery, the Lifcott, Morris and Drake's family of Barbados, the Joseph family of Trinidad, the Cauldron family of Cicero, the Edwin family of Block BS CDC, the Daniel family of La Pansy, the Burke family of Castries, Beaufort, St. Croix and the U.S., the Belize family of Leslie Land, his neighbors and friends at Marisol, including Janice, Deborah, Jeanette and Joe, his friends at the Castries Fisherman's Cooperative, his friends at Wasco, Lucille Nicolette of Rodney Bay, Mr. Taylor of Miku. The funeral service of the late Hugh Lawrence Lifcott will be held on Tuesday, May 13th at the Holy Trinity Anglican Church, Trinity Church Road, Castries, at 2 p.m. The body will be laid to rest at the Shock Cemetery. The body now lies at the Crick's Funeral Home, Vidbutai, Castries. May his soul rest in perfect peace. Please note that Octave's Autoparts at Mongiro and Marianne Street will be closed on Tuesday, May 13th.